Well, as you can see, the boys are now practicing uh, pit stops, which is one of the most important things um, for our race to make sure they're absolutely perfect every time you get in. So let's go have a look. Well, it's uh, Tuesday morning, it's that time. It's uh, time to go and do the driver's briefing. We've got a fantastic array of drivers in here, and we'll try and get a glimpse when we're in, in the meeting. And there's one. Well, Alan's come along to borrow my bike because he wants to go around with Dr. Ulrich. So I, I, I modified it for his height. So when he sit when he gets the bike, the, the seat will probably be taller than his head. He said he adjusted the seat for me. You know, this is ridiculous. It's far too small for me. You need to stabilize the channel, you're right. I need Where's the Andrea stabilizers. Where's the step ladder? <laughs> Genius. Hey look there's a seat on there. <laughs> Well, here we are at uh, a Michelin function. We have no idea what's going on, but uh, something very special, I think, is going to happen. Um, here with uh, my, my teammate from last year, Alexander. I'm hey, still hey. shocked by your technology. <laughs> I know, it's and, unbelievable. You know, huh? Forward thinking, brilliant. Cool, you're going to yes. win again? Well, what do you think? Of course. Yeah, good. Good answer. So, you see. <laughs> Let's go and have a look. <laughs> Hey Mark, right here guys, Dave. Well I think you're just looking at three very stunned racing drivers. Um, to come here to Michelin, we, Mark said it great because he said uh, I thought we were coming here to sign autographs but to be presented with three spectacular looking go-karts is um, well, it's pretty, pretty amazing really, it's never really happened to me before and, um, and I'm, so, I'm so pleased to actually share it with my two teammates which uh, I have a lot of, a lot of good friendship with them and uh, to win Le Mans with them was very spectacular and what do you think mate, what do you reckon? Well I'm still stumped because you know even in my go-kart days I had to buy a go-kart so now I got one, um, that makes me a factory runner doesn't it? Yes. Yeah cool, I've done it now. <laughs> Yeah, of course, you know, uh, we all do go-karting to prepare ourselves as being better drivers, so now we have an advantage comparing to the other drivers, and if we are strong this year, we'll be even stronger next year. And my problem is um, trying to get my 15-year-old uh, out of it. <laughs> 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 I'm not quicker than you. I'm going to try. If you're going to try. <laughs>